America Rakow is live in Miami with all the fun there and the big star. Is he there yet? He's here. We're trying to follow him around. He's making his way around this field to meet with obviously all the kids and their parents that are here. Right now he's at the end of this field. We're at the Boys and Girls Club of Miami. So this is called the AARP Jose Fernandez Parent and Child Baseball Pro Camp. The pitcher is here working with 100 kids and their parents, some grandparents. We also have uh, people like the Cardinals pitcher, Ronnie Williams. There's high school coaches. They're going to different stations. They're working on things like hitting, fielding, throwing base running. This was advertised through a bunch of different youth baseball groups, so it's a really great uh, experience. These parents tell me it's a bonding moment for them. They get to meet with Jose Fernandez. Their kids get to meet him, take some pictures, learn some things from him. We got to catch up with the pitcher just a few minutes ago and also had the opportunity to ask him about all these rumors we've been hearing regarding the Miami Marlins trading him. This is what he had to say. What about the rumors about you being traded? Do you want to be in Miami next season? Uh, I'm not going to answer that, but, uh, you know, I love to play baseball. Uh, I don't, I didn't pay much, much attention to it. You know, I got, I got one goal, and I got to get ready. And, and if I'm not ready, it don't matter. It don't matter. But, uh, you know, I'm working hard, and I'm staying patient. Uh. And so we also spoke with some parents, and they say they're obviously here today to see Jose Fernandez, and it's a great experience, but they say they also go to the games to see him, so they'd be really sad to see him go, too. This is the first time he says he's been able to do a camp like this, and he's really enjoying it, never got to do something like this growing up in Cuba. It's a great day out here, Todd and Cheyenne. They dodged the rain. It was pouring about a half hour before this started, but they'll be out here doing fun things through noon. All right, and good question. So he didn't all the way dodge it. He did answer it, so Clay and Will will be helpful. Happy you got that, Erica. Break it down later today. That's right, Erica. Thanks. Well, dozens.